Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of the Cobra Daytona Build. On this episode, I'm actually gonna marry the transmission to the uh, motor, uh, the engine. So my son's actually gonna help out. We've gotta index the bell housing first. I've never done that before, so that may be a whole episode. We'll see how that goes. As I said, I've never done it, so we're gonna give it a shot and see how it goes. So follow along and uh, looking forward to you uh, seeing what this adventure is all about today. Thanks. Okay, so the engine is, uh, Got my mounts bolted up. We're gonna let it lift this thing up, uh, get it off the uh, engine stand, and uh, then we'll start cleaning up. We'll show you how we're gonna prep the bell housing, the flywheel, and uh, get some of these things bolted up. So, engine is coming on up. Okay, so we got the engine up off the engine stand. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a block here, uh, aluminum flat piece, and I'm just gonna make sure we're kind of cleaning up. This way we deburr anything that could possibly hold up the bell housing on this back side. Okay. There we go. Okay, so we've got our flywheel on here. So we're gonna uh, put it on. It says you don't have to have all the bolts in. So let me grab the fly flywheel bolts, which I assume are these. They look a little small, actually, but... Let's make sure these are the right... Yeah, okay. Okay, throw that thing on there. Don't drop the dang thing. Lined up. That might be it. Yeah, just so you know, that's the only way. So you may get one or two in, but then the others will not go. That's just the way flywheels are. The bolts are never, yeah. All the bolts in the flywheel we're just tightening these down somewhat we actually probably should have deburred the back of the flywheel and we pull it back off before we bolt this up we will do that just to make sure it's flat back there um so now what i'm going to do is we're going to check this check the spacer plate which feels really good probably should have deburred that we may pull it back off so we're going to throw the bell housing on now um, but i am going to sand, hit that with a little bit of sandpaper just like i did the other one So we're gonna take this and just kind of make sure that it's flat. Okay, bolt this thing up. I'll throw that up on there. That is the bottom. Oh uh, no, yeah, it's top. There you go. This side. this side it does. This side's no issues. Hmm. Well, 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 there should be two more, I think, down low. Um, ah, here we go. I think this is the piece. How's that? That look better? I think that solves the problem right there. Yep, there we go. Must be two different systems they have. So we're getting all these bolts. This one's got this weird moon shape thing, as you can see. So there was actually two of them in the package. The other one, um, what the hell did I do with it? I don't know what I did with it. Um, but it didn't fit. So there's actually two different ones of these weird spacers kind of hold it down. So we'll uh, snug these up. I think it's gotta be torqued to 35 to 45 feet pounds. And they want this to actually torque to spec before you start doing everything. 
So we're just snugging these bolts up first and then we'll put a torque wrench on. It says you want to uh, hit them 35 to 45 feet pounds according to Lakewood uh, bell housing scatter shield instructions. So we'll, we're going to basically follow their instructions and go with that. With the T56, you can't index off the bell housing like a normal transmission. So you have to buy this plate, $70 for this, um, yeah. So this thing actually bolts up into here like so. Like that, and I gotta put four bolts into this and then we can index off this. Um, and that's how you index a uh, T56 Magnum transmission. So follow along, we'll get this thing set up. I gotta find the bolts for this. Thing. We're gonna put these in, making sure they don't come into contact with the bell housing back there so we don't scratch the paint, which that's why I had to go shorter than what the ones that bolt to the transmission, so. And these ones are short enough where they do not, hopefully. We good? Yeah, the bottom ones have got plenty of plenty. We got our magnetic base. Um, this is actually going to go in, and I think we may have to. Yeah, I hate to say this. I think I'm gonna have to pull out some of these uh, bolts. Uh, because you know what, I think I gotta pull out maybe three or four of the, this is why they said don't put all the flywheel bolts in there because now I've got no way to mount this. So I'm thinking if I take two and two out, I'll be able to get into this a little easier. I'm gonna pull two of those flywheel bolts out to make this easier to mount in there. So as you can see, I took a couple of flywheel bolts out. So in this base, goes up into here, hopefully you can see this, like this, it's got a place to mount to. And you see, now we're solid. So that's how you mount your base. Uh, so I've still got four flywheel bolts, and they say couple is fine. Um, so now we'll get the uh, gauge hooked up. I had to modify my, um, uh, my dial indicator a little bit to make it fit. Uh, it was too long, so we had to take it apart somewhat. But uh, as you can see, I got it zeroed now. We're pointing straight down. So we're going to start rotating this now until we get to our maximum number. So my son will keep an eye on this as I rotate from the front. So we got about point, uh, zero, zero five and a half thousandths right now is what our runout is. So we're just so close. But then I noticed our zero here. We're off by a little bit, so I'm gonna re-zero this thing. We're gonna run it around again, because we are very, very close. Oh, this whole thing just went, okay. oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We're going cattywampus here. Okay, this thing's slipping around. Okay, hold on, I, got, I think I gotta tighten everything back up. I think we're loose, we gotta run this here. Okay, so we had to redo our mount. Uh, it wasn't that sturdy, we were getting about uh, five and a half thou, about uh, yeah, ten and a half thousandths total between top and bottom of the lowest and the highest, which was just a hair above where it should be. But the mount was moving. You touch the gauge, and now you touch the gauge, and look at that. It's rock solid. So we're going to go and find the uh, most positive point, and then go from there. So we'll start rotating the motor. Uh, you want to rotate the motor around, Brown? Okay, so you can see we're climbing. You see the numbers are climbing now. So we're... 75, 77, there's 80, 82, hopefully it doesn't keep climbing or we're going to be in a world error. Okay, hold on. Okay, so I think 82 is about max. Uh, rotate it back a little bit. Yeah, it started to drop back down there. Perfect, right there. Hold on, there we go. So it's just a hair over 82. So I'm going to zero this gauge. Okay, let's uh, rotate on around. So now we're going to rotate around again. 180 degrees, and hopefully we're less than uh, 10 thou off. So I'm gonna kind of take the camera here. So we're at uh, 
three thou now whatever we come up with here does get divided by two so that's why we got some wiggle room here okay so we're up to about uh what's that six and a half now hopefully it doesn't keep growing or i'm gonna have to order some offset So we're right at 90 now. Hopefully that's it. If it keeps growing, I'm screwed. And nope, it looks like it maxed out. Keep going. Yep, so I think I'm at max allowable limit. I'm at right at, so now we're dropping back down. So so we're definitely at the, uh, we're at the 5,000th range. I mean, right on it. So, but that they say is max. So I'm not gonna worry about it. This is now gonna continue dropping down. So. As far as I'm concerned, uh, we're basically zero and 90. That's about what it hit. So we'll pull this thing off and uh, we'll get it bolted up. This is probably gonna be an episode in itself just because of the issues we have, but uh, right at 0 .005. So I would love better, but that's what it is.